International law states that medical workers and ambulance drivers tending to the wounded must not be targeted under any circumstances. To do so is a war crime. In the 23-day attack on Gaza, the Israeli army is accused of ignoring that basic law of war, killing 16 medical workers and wounding a further 22. They also bombed 15 of Gaza's 27 hospitals. In scenes like this one, filmed on January the 7th, the ambulance men can be clearly seen trying to pick up the body of a man lying on the ground. The Israeli army continue to fire on them as they try to run back to their ambulance. One of the medics is hit in the leg. Other paramedics told the Guardian how their ambulances had been directly targeted. <laughs> Israel is a pioneer of precision weapons and a world leader in advanced optics. Their weapons have viewfinders that are so crystal clear that, according to the Israeli military themselves, they can see the color of a target's clothes. So why were 38 medical workers killed or injured by the Israeli forces when they had the technology to see exactly who they were hitting? On January 4th, ambulance drivers Yasser and Hazim were two of five medics called out to an olive grove to collect the wounded. As they tried to help the injured men, a helicopter gunship opened fire on them. The Israeli army uses a sophisticated computer targeting system in their helicopter.